Hey guys, Psycho Revolution here, and welcome to my Gmon Machinima Making Guide. You're watching Numero 5, and this one I'm going to be talking about sound. Not just any sound, game sounds, and how do you get them? How do you get those TF2 voiceover files? Well, you've come to the right place. Let's get started. Now, if you want to be able to access the sound files, you're going to need this program. The link's in the description. This is a must-have. It's called GCF Scape. So you need to go ahead and download this. I ain't going to click it because I already got it. Why are you going to Windows Basic? You have issues, my friend. Okay. Anyway, so we got this downloaded, I'm going to assume. So let's hop on over to our Steam Apps folder. Now, now that you got GFscape, you're going to see a bunch of these .gcf files and .ncf files. And these are what the program is going to interact with and be able to open up so you can look inside. So for my example, we're, we're going to do Team Fortress 2. So let's click on Team Fortress 2 Content. And now this is going to open GCFscape. And we can click on TF Sound. And then here's all the sound for Team Fortress. So we can see all these voiceovers and stuff. And so we want this whole thing. Unless for some reason you only want part of it. And what do we do? We hit... I have issues. Okay. Highlight them. Right click. Hit extract. Now, you need a place to put them. I've got a place where I put all my sound, but for the sake of this, I'll just make a folder here. TF2 sound. Okay. So now, this program is going to extract all that sound onto my folder, which I created. And then I can then use that in all the machinima I make. And you can do this for all the Valve games, you just gotta find the right folders. Here's Left 4 Dead sound. It's pretty explanatory. So now we got all these sounds. I can do the same thing for this, and I'll have Left 4 Dead. You just gotta look around, do some investigating, and find out. And all your Steam games are gonna be in here, so... You might be able to get the sound from them. You're just going to have to experiment, try it out. Also, if you go to your common folder, you can find there's some normal folders here, and some games have stuff in here, like Mountain Blade Warband. I can just access the sounds from right here. Come on, baby, load. So now I've got all the sounds from Mountain Blade. And I can then save them to my desktop or wherever I want and use them. So I'm not going to go over how to do every game imaginable, how to get the sound. That's part of making Gmon Machinima. You gotta be inventive. You gotta go out there and find it for yourself. So. Is this done extracting? Almost. I guess I'll wait. Just for the hell of it. What did I name this? T. TF2 sound. Point is now available for capture. And it works. Imagine that. So, now you know how to get your sounds. And these sounds are really important. There'll be a video later on in which I discuss the importance of sound, sound effects, and music. But that's for another day. So, until next time, stay sexy.